What's going on guys? Twin coming at you with another MLB The Show 19 video. Today we are trying to get closer and closer to World Series. Obviously trying to win this ranked seasons game here in Diamond Dynasty. So we're going for 88 or more likes on this video. Subscribe if you guys are new on the road to 25,000 subscribers. And comment down below if you guys just have a day to do nothing. What is your favorite thing to do to relax? Mine is probably watch... Uh, either Twitch or YouTube and eat junk food. That's probably like my go-to relaxing day and uh, Let me know yours down in that comment section. Let's go ahead hop into this game rank seasons game Get the W. We're playing this Chirac Prisoners. Our opponent has 99 Tony Gwynn, 90 future stars Fernando Tatis Jr., Cody Bellinger, Nolan Arenado, Christian Yelich, Jose Altuve, 89 from McGriff, 85 Jonathan Luke Roy. We both have signature series Kershaw on the mound. I can already tell it's going to be a little bit of a pitcher's duel here today. We're the way team. Looking for the dub. And ball forward to Tony Gwynn to lead off the game. It was a 3-0 count, and I'm figuring just leave my hands off the controller. Don't swing at the pitch and uh, see what we can do. Lead off base runner, Kershaw on the mound, Chris Bryant up to bat. Also, to let me know down in the comment section, how do you like these changes to my road jerseys? Where it's the black logo with the blue outline on the front, just like the numbers on the back. And I just want to say, too, it feels like you guys are almost split 50-50. Half of you love my new uniforms. The other half think they're trash. And one thing that I want to point out that I'm probably going to change is instead of the blue, uh, it's kind of like it's kind of like a mint green, teal blue. It kind of looks different depending on what screen you're watching on, uh, the, the lighting, whatever. Uh, but it's a blue. It's a teal. Kind of looks like mint green. But what I'm trying to say is I'm thinking about changing that to... A similar red, pink, maroon, whatever color uh, my logo is. I'm thinking about changing the blue to that. I feel like that would make a little bit more sense. And I feel like it would still look really pretty sick with the jerseys that I'm rocking, especially the home ones. So I'm probably going to try switching to that. JT Real Muto with my first hit. I was thinking Altuve was going to make a dun -na 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 top 10 play, but... We're getting that base hit. Kershaw off to bat. You guys know whenever my pitcher's up, I watch until two strikes. Even if we get a pitch down the middle, it's just like, yeah, it could have been a good pitch to hit. But these are extra pitches I can be making Kershaw use to hopefully get his pitch count up, get him tired, and get to his bullpen a little bit faster. Tony Gwynn. Oh, dang it. Thought we might get our second hit of the game. Two down, 73 speed on first for a good old Chris Bryant. Looking for a base hit here. No, Clayton Kershaw breaks up Clayton Kershaw's perfect game. Dang it. I swear, I said this yesterday too. I give up so many hits to pitchers, it's crazy. Uh, I did hang a, uh, a curveball right there, so like it wasn't a great pitch or anything. But I still give up a lot of hits to pitchers. Don Mattingly, there we go. Two on base hit, two down, like I said, fourth inning, top of the fourth inning. And that was pitch number, I think, 55, 55 from Clayton Kershaw. Yeah, 55 right there. Oh, I thought that was it. I dropped the PCI. Yo, I was seriously so ready to just get pumped, get hyped for Andrew Jones two run shot there. Oh, that was so close. I actually love my away uniforms. I'm thinking though I might change the socks to black with where the blue is right now being an accent. So uh, if it's a stirrup sock, right now the sock is blue with the stirrup, the part underneath uh, black. And I'm thinking I might just flip flop it because I think the blue's a little bit too bright and just doesn't go with my uniforms currently. But I feel like that's actually a big change. The guys with high socks would look a lot better. See, look at the, uh, wait, no, the second base, my shortstop, my creative player, that's how I want it to be. But then Don Mattingly, I wanted to be flip-flopped. I want his socks to be black with the underneath part blue. Created player, let's go, that's huge. Up the middle, 84 speed to lead off the inning, okay? Leading off the inning, 84 speed. I'm seeing the ball pretty well right now. We got to drive him in here. JT Real Muto, back-to-back -back base hits. In the comments section, let me know right now, if you guys are watching, would you bunt with Kershaw here? Would you bunt to try to advance the runners over, have runners on second and third with only one down? Is that what y'all would do? Because I'm really, I, I'm torn. I have no clue what I feel like I should be doing here. 
See, now it's just an out. Infield fly rule, and the runners are first and second. If I would have bunted, there could be the chance that the runners are in scoring position with this out right now. Tony Gwynn, check swing, 89 speed, out. Okay, so two down, two runners in scoring position for Chris Bryan here. Oh, Lord, this is intense. I got to come through. He's intentionally walking Chris Bryant to get to, I think, Steve Finley. This isn't good, but Steve Finley has had some lefty on lefty crime in this ballpark. I'm pretty sure off of Sig Kershaw. Steve Finley. Oh, dang. I was so excited, too. If you guys couldn't tell, base is loaded. And we're flying out. I feel like that one and the Andrew Jones one, I can't wait to, like, slow it down and edit and go frame by frame and just see how much we missed it by. Because I feel like it's, it's going to be, like, actual millimeters, honestly, because... It felt pretty good. I think the Andrew Jones one felt a little bit better, but I feel like we're just missing these, and I'm sad that we couldn't score a run right there, and I almost wish that I would have actually bunted with Kershaw, but I just, I, 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 I have not bunted this year. I don't think I have legitimately bunted this year, so I have no clue if it actually does work or not. Don Mattingly puts a drive into it. Oh, dang it. I got to see the contact on that one, the result, because... That felt like, I would say, my best contact of the game. I want to say, oh, yeah, dude. Oh, can I show it? Is it going to be quick enough? No. Nah. Literally good squared up. Obviously, you guys saw that. But it was just centered in the PCI. Magnificent. Beautiful. It felt awesome. And Luke Croy getting our opponent's second hit of the game. I thought maybe he might be covering first. So, Kershaw up to bat for him. We'll give him time to take him out if he wants to. He's not... Okay, so let's see if bunting works. So that's a leadoff base hit for Kershaw. Oh, wait. Oh. I actually wanted him to bunt. So leadoff base hit for him. Kershaw up. He has Kershaw. Kershaw has half of our opponent's hits this game. He's stealing. He's bunting. Bunting did work. I thought he was going to be safe. I was scared. Runner in scoring position. Only one down. We got to be careful here. Tony Gwynn up the middle. I'm going to just throw home because if he goes home, we need to get him. All right, runners on the corners. Guys, this is tough. Runners on the corners, only one down. I'm scared. Huge strike out of Tatis Jr. Cody Bellinger up facing his teammate Kershaw. Two down, two on. And getting the strikeout, getting out of the inning. There we go, Kershaw. Let's go. Now we have our creative player, JT Realmuto. And then Kershaw. I'm thinking we're going to leave Kershaw in. He's only at like 60, maybe 65 pitches for me. Nolan Arenado, leadoff base hit for my opponent again. What What? Like, what like? did I change? Is Kershaw just getting lower on energy or am I I'm getting predictable? I, I don't know. Because I was so good at pitching for the first five innings. And then last two innings, I've been giving up base hits left and right. I'm kind of scared. Altuve getting a base hit. Oh, Lord. This is not good. Runners on the corners. Oh, my goodness. Again, runners on the corners. Only one down. I'm scared now. Oh, my Lanta. Bottom of the seventh inning. Mm -mm. We can't allow a run here. Please, please, please. Let's go. Wow. Painting that high inside corner. Jeez Louise. Getting out of the inning. It was a full count. Kershaw was on deck. I probably should have just walked Luke Roy to get to Kershaw, but I think that would have been what? Bases loaded with a pinch hitter. I wasn't feeling it. I'm glad we got that out. Chris Bryant, let's go. That one is not staying in the park. That one is a solo home run. One out, top of inning number eight to put us in the lead. Let's go, dude. Oh, that feels good. Wow, I needed that. Ball four to Steve Finley. Yo, if this could turn into a few more insurance runs, Kershaw over 100 pitches, I would 100% take that. Trevor Story into the gap, 66 speed. Do we risk it? It's going to be close. It's going to be close, but we are risking it. We're risking it. We're risking it. Let's go. He's safe. Yes. Two to nothing lead and the runners in scoring position. Let's go. Bro, the PCI looks so laggy. Look at that. Yo, are you got ball four, by the way, but were you guys seeing that, how laggy that looked? That was weird. Andrew Jones. I can't believe I popped that one up. Oh, infield fly rule. 
I think it's my creative player, though, which is a good situation. Yeah, it is. That's good. Creative player. Some good contact. Nothing going to come from it, though. Dang it. At least we got the run. No, we got two. Yeah, 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 yeah. We got two runs in the inning. Kershaw six outs away from a complete game shutout. If he gets into any type of trouble, especially in the ninth inning, though, I got guys in the bullpen who are ready to go. And I think I'm going to have a quick uh, hook. Is that what you say? A quick hook if I'm going to take him out of the game here? I honestly think, and if you guys have any other pitchers that you would say deserves the spot, but in my opinion, let me know in the comments. But in my opinion, Signature Series Kershaw right now is the best pitcher in the game. I don't think I've faced anyone that has been harder for me to hit, and I don't think I've done as well with any other pitcher as I have with him. Our signature series, Kershaw, going for the complete game shutout in the bottom of inning number nine. He's going to get another at-bat in this inning. Like I said, though, I have a short leash on him if he, uh, if he starts to get into some trouble, but I'm not even sure if he's at 90 pitches. I feel like he's definitely earned the opportunity to go back out there, especially because we have a two-run lead. If it was only one, I would probably go to a closer, but we have a run to work with. I think he deserves it. Tony Gwynn going to be getting, I don't know if that's considered an error or a base hit because he's fast, so it would have been a tough play anyways. It's considered a base hit. I think if it was someone slower and he got it, would have been an error, but that's a two-out base hit. Chris Bryant up to bat. Already has a homer today. Looking to make it two. We're going to steal. I never steal. Hit and run. Not going to work out. Going to the bottom of the ninth inning. Signature Series Kershaw on the mound. Looking for the complete game shutouts. Let's go. Big out number one for Kershaw. Arenado up to bat now. Two away. Pitch number 97. Here's the deal. I'm leaving him in for the lefty. After this batter, we're going matchups. I'm going to the bullpen. 99.9 .9 exit velo. Christian Yelich flying out for uh, for out number two. Do I leave him in? Or do I go with the matchup? What do I do? I really want to leave him in. Altuve, there's no way Altuve hits a home run, right? There's no way. Let's go. Clayton Kershaw, complete game shutout. I had faith in you the entire way. I never thought about taking anyone uh, or putting anyone in the game for you. I never even warmed anybody up, okay? No, definitely not. And that was a fun game. Like, <laughs> it's not as action-packed as an all-star game. A game on all-star difficulty. But I just, I love Hall of Fame and Legend. I think, I don't, I, I don't know which one I like more. I haven't played enough games on Legend. I think I might like Hall of Fame more just because... Legend's so hard for me, but I really enjoy these games, these close games where I feel like it's harder to hit and everything. I don't know exactly how to explain it, but I, I definitely enjoy these uh, higher rated games a little bit more. Let's go ahead and see what my rating went up by. I doubt it did, but I really hope that got my rating up 35. I would love to be in championship series. However, I wouldn't mind for tomorrow's ranked seasons video if we win we're in championship series. So we got plus 24. That means tomorrow's ranked seasons video. If we win, we make championship series. I'm a dog person. I've never had a cat, so I can't really comment on them. I've never interacted with too many cats. My neighbors have them. They're super sweet uh, from the few times that I have, but that is adorable. That's a very, very, very cute cat. I'm hoping we can get this. Really? All I want is a cat icon, and I can't even give it to me. That's sad. Um. Oh, why? Well, I think I might have that. I definitely have a cat one regardless. I have a dog. Uh, right now as my one I think there's a icon a universal icon that's like a World Series trophy and I wouldn't mind having that paired with the World Series I'm not sure I really want the 12 and 0 nameplate I would love it if there was a 12 and 0 icon or like maybe if you went 12 and 0 five times you got a special icon like something in addition to the 12 and 0 nameplate uh, I think would be really cool just to reward people who can continue to go 12 and oh we're up to 789 i'm actually digging my team right now i don't know that this is the issue don mattingly i i think i might put cody bellinger back in there 
it's just Don Mattingly, his vision's a lot higher. So lefty on lefty is just easier. I really am not sure, though. And it's a, it's a day by day thing for me who I won at first base. I'll see you guys next time. Like, comment, subscribe, follow on Twitter, Twitch, Instagram, and the second channel. All that's down in the description. Thank you guys, as always, for watching. I'll be the fantastic rest of your day. 99 Kershaw, definitely the best pitcher in, in the game, in my opinion. Thank you so much for watching. Have a fantastic rest of your day. I might have said that already. Either way, I hope you guys do. Peace out.